Hello, beautiful people of the internet. My name is Ryan, and welcome back to our Skyrim blind series here on YouTube. Welcome back to our Elder Scrolls Skyrim blind series here. It's it's episode 240, and we have an Elder Scroll. Can I pickpocket? No, because she's a companion. Damn it. She won't let me see your inventory, and I want to see what's in your inventory, Serana. God damn it. Welcome back. Uh, in the last episode, shit went down. Last episode was one of the more shocking episodes i can remember um we started the dongar dlc we arrived here at crypt hollow dim hollow crypt <laughs> i think is what it's called dim hollow crypt dim hollow cavern is is inside of it there was an insane puzzle that made me uh squirm with the way that it cut my hand a vampire who's attractive appeared out of the out of the puzzle and now we have to lead her back home. And well, maybe most shocking of all, I think I might be on the side of the vampires at the end of this. I, I don't really know. There's a button here. We're on the way out. I don't know where we're going exactly. I don't know. It opened that door. <gasps> you bitch. But it's all, it also opened these. It also opened these. Ah! And I'm going to try and shoot him. Uh, I'm gonna try and shoot him. Oh, there's so many of them. Oh my god. All right. Screw the, screw the, oh no. Screw the crossbow. We're just gonna have to kill this Draugr Deathlord using Dawnbreaker the old fashioned way. Come here. You're, flee you're fleeing from me, but you should not. It's really dark. I can't see anything. Uh, all right, we're on it. We're on it. We're on it. Let's go. Are there more? There's one here. Okay. Sit down, son. Done and done, done, and done Serana says. Done and done. Y'all want some heals? I only... I didn't get either of you. Okay. Uh, sweet. We have some skeletons to loot. Uh, nothing interesting. It is so dark in here. So the button opened up some skeletons and then also opened up this door. Uh, our goal for this episode is to get to wherever this, wherever this quest... Uh, wants to take us and it won't tell me it won't tell me where it wants to it it won't tell me uh <gasps> nope i thought that was it damn it just still says uh lead serana to her home it's some island west of solitude and my my mind is my mind is racing with possibilities for that racing with possibilities okay I love these drawings. Okay, okay. Did you hear something? Did you? <sighs> oh my god, you can! Oh, you just right click while you are left clicking. You can't really ADS, but you can't, like, you don't actually aim down the sights. But you do get to slow time and. I think it slows time. And uh, use your stamina. Did I hear something? Um, there's a Draugr. There's a Skelly boy right there. I think that's a Draugr Death Lord. Oh, hello. I don't think that was counted as a sneak attack. I, this thing is so satisfying. Holy shit. It makes the best noise. Oh my god, it's so much fun. Who? You right there, right? Oh, you guys aren't even awake yet. That's okay. I'll still set you down. Oh. Hello. How is that a sneak attack? Draugr Death Overlord. Take that to the head, my friend. Take that to the head, my friend. Oh, I need heal. I need heals. Oh, no. I don't know if that actually heals either of you. I don't even know if she can be healed. She's a vampire. Does that affect the way that she gets healed? Like, or magic done upon her? Like, Dwemer machines? I don't know. Ah! I didn't block that at all. I deserve that. I deserve that. I didn't block it. I'm a little rusty. Okay. We got this. When did I last quick save? Fuck. 
I didn't quick save it all. Damn it. Who's there? Didn't quick save at all. Of course I did not. Alright, we got this. This time. Stop it. Stop it. Oh! You're Serranus. What? You're on our team. He's hiding back here. Huh. Alright. She raises a... Did I know vampires could do that? Did you summon it? Or did you... What did you do to make that happen? Or is he just your friend? Did you wake him up here? You summoned him probably, right? Conjured him, I mean. What? Huh. All right, we quick save this time. Um, Interesting. I bet that's what I killed earlier. Did you hear something, she'll say. Stay on your guard. Nope. <laughs> just stay on your guard. All right. Uh... Which one's the overlord? I think it's this one, right? That one's just a skeleton. Shit. That one is also a skeleton. Dead. Oh, I'm getting a phone call. Hope that's not my wife. It's not. Excuse me, I'm trying to win Skyrim fights over here. How dare you. Uh, uh, that one's our friendly one. Okay. You're the death overlord. Maybe you were down in the middle by that fiery pit of hell. Honestly, we should just mark for death you just because it would make sense. It would make sense. We don't have to, we don't have to avoid it. Nope. I just unmarked it. Shit. You're not going to keep me in here. You're not. All right, let's kill some other boys while that while that does its work. Let's kill some other guys while that does its work. Kill you. Uh, now you have been marked for death, and therefore you shall die. Please die. Let's heal you guys if we can. Oh, dude, the the crew is rolling three deep now. We're too good. We're too good. Y'all should be scared. We're too good at this point. Let's bump it up to legendary difficulty. It's, you know, now that Serana's on our side, you are on our side, aren't you, Serana? For good? I hope so. Heck, we're rolling four deep, technically, with Skelly Boy over here. Jack Skellington over here. Rolling four deep. Uh, we should loot that, uh, that death. <gasps> I thought I heard chanting. Oh my god, I did not even look around. Incredible. Hell yeah. Hell yes. Hell yeah. All right, let's save uh, and let's put some uh, some candlelight in the air because it is dark. Get me and Jazargo some romantic lighting. It's really a shame Serana, Serana, Serano, Serana uh, appeared at the time she did. You know, if I had any other follower, she would be the most attractive follower that I have, but... This fucking doofus is instead taking that title. Uh, I mean, this guy, this this very sexy Khajiit. Uh, uh oh, is that bugged or no? Oh no. Um, drain vitality. No. Oh. Oh, okay. Drain Vitality is a DLC shout. It has to be. That makes so much sense, too, because I think the bug that I got earlier with Marked for Death was reliant upon you having the Dawn Guard DLC installed. I'm going to assign that so that we can remember to do it. Let's Drain Vitality from somebody next time. Max... Magical and mortal energies. Do I take both their health and their uh, their magic? 
Magicka? That's what it sounds like. Serrano, what are you doing over there? You twerking? Uh, cool. Okay. It's a great day already. I got a new shout to try out. Draft of resistance. Uh, fire. Stone flesh. We know that. Some gold. All right, we got a place out right there. We should go down and check out what's actually down here. Um, oh, we got some burnt, some real burnt, real toasty corpses. Whew. I am sweating just looking at you. Damn, real toasty. Uh, what else we got? Something up in this corner, maybe? Nothing. Cool. So. Uh, let's get the fuck out of here then. Cool. Let's figure out where Serana, where Serana's home is. Quick save and get out of here. Okay. Uh. On that screen, there were eight dragon priests, <sighs> and maybe a ninth one at the again. top. Even in this weather, it's Do I have eight the of them? Cave. Even in this weather, weather, it's better than the cave. You went to bed, uh, Ms. Rumpelstiltskin, uh, probably at least a thousand years ago. I don't know Skyrim's timeline well enough, but you went a long fucking time ago. It is Icewater Jetty. Let's fucking go. I'm so excited. Oh my god. Yes! Yes! Oh, this makes me so happy. Where are we currently? There is a standing stone over there that I kind of want to go to. Um, Can we fast travel to... We should go to the Hall of the Vigilant at some point, right? It doesn't even say that we should. It just... uh. All right, let's try and run uphill real quick. See if we can get to this uh, standing stone. If we cannot, we will very much just fast travel to the ice water jetty. But I do. Who's there? It's a fucking cat. That's who's there. While we have a, a standing stone close, I do want to uh, take the opportunity to done hit it. And done. done and done, indeed. I have saber cats. All right. Uh. Cool. Can I heal you? You did not glow, but Jazargo did. Interesting. I wonder if it's because technically I haven't agreed to have you as a follower yet. You've just sort of made yourself a follower. There's people over here. Quick save. These are no cro crossbow, which is over halfway gone with its ammo, or about halfway gone with its ammo so far. Who are you? Are you chill? If I put my weapons away? No, you're not chill. Maybe? Go to sleep. Take the bad time to get lost, friend. Go to sleep. <laughs> I love that he's rushing me with an axe and I'm crossbowing him from uh <laughs> from point fucking blank. Uh Alright, those guys are decent. I'm gonna have to go up and kill him with my sword. Boy, bandits. Uh, I guess we are in the snow right now, too. We should just generally, I think, keep an eye out for Falmer, just in case. Did you fall downhill yet? Uh, I mean, I think they tend to be in caves more than anything, but... Listen, will you stop it? That actually hurts. There we go. There we go. All right. So what is this stone? And then we can get on with the Dawn Guard DLC. Uh, what are you? The Lord Stone. Okay. What's going on here? Just some, just some beds, just some bed rolls. The Lord Stone. Those under the sign of the Lord are more resistant to both Magicka and physical damage. You may only have one sign blessing at a time. Magicka and physical. Okay. Uh, interesting. So the current stone that we are under is actually uh the one the, the one that gives you 10 percent to everything right 
15 percent to everything cool and uh, i think i still want that one i could use the extra 15 percent right now uh this one seems fine maybe in the future we could use it but all right let's go to like north watch keep <laughs> see what happens Oh my god, I'm so excited to go out to the jetty! Uh, if you guys weren't here, I mean, I'm imagining everyone here was here for it, but if you guys weren't here, I was so intrigued. First off, fuck this place. I was so intrigued by that. Off the coast, I couldn't get there. I tried to get there, but I couldn't go there. A hundred episodes ago, probably. I was so intrigued by it. But at the, at the time, it, it sort of was made clear to me that I would get there eventually. Um, I would get there eventually if I just was patient and played the game. That's it, out there to the north. We used to keep a boat around here to get there and back. It's right here. It's right up here. It's right up here. I don't know that it's the same boat, because if it is the same boat, it would be literally a thousand plus years old, but you ready to do this? What now? I think we should do it. Yeah? Travel? To Castle Volcalar? Oh my god, are we going to be on the side of the vampires this DLC? Oh, please don't make me do, do a tough ethical choice. I don't know that I have it in me. Are those gargoyles? I'm about to have to fuck up a gargoyle? Dude, this is incredible. This is incredible. Here we are. Ready this is your home? This is it. Home sweet castle. Why didn't you tell me it was so huge? That's which. I didn't want you to think I was one of those, you know, the women who just sit in their castle all day. I don't know. Coming from a place like this, well, it's not really me. I hope you can believe that. Hold this up, I'm gonna it? go for the other dialogue Honestly, option too. It's impressive. It's something, all right. I need to trade some things with you. Why don't you keep your things God and I'll it. keep mine? <laughs> Sorana, I want to see what your fucking Elder Scroll is about. God damn it. Fishing supply. Oh, shit. There was a bucket and something in it. I kicked the bucket. All right. Well. Just in case. I will kill a fucking gargoyle. I will. I'll do it. You coming with me or... Uh... I was not about to walk past that thing until I was goddamn sure that it wasn't going to turn on me. At the last second. Alright, cool. Not that it would. It would make no sense to, like, get here for the story, but... But still... Hello, friend. Uh... Do you mind opening the door? Go on, get out of here. Go on, get out of here. Serana? Did you fall off an edge here? What happened? Serana, are you coming? I just bumped her off the ledge. Are you going? Hey, so before we go I in see. There, My bad. Uh, what is it? I wanted to thank you for getting me this far. But after we get in there, I'm going to go my own way for a while. I think... I'm gonna I know go your my friends own would probably way. want to kill everything in here. I'm hoping you can show some more control than that. Once we're inside, just keep quiet for a bit. Let me take the lead. Okay. Sure. I'm into that. Do you need something? Nope, let's do it. You coming? Okay, good. Yeah, I'm definitely going to keep quiet. I mean, I'm a, I'm brand new to the Dawn Guard, so I'm not, like, emotionally attached to slaying every vampire that I've ever met. It's just sort of that, like, every vampire I've ever met has sort of needed slaying, if you know what I mean. Minus Babette. She's actually... She's grown on me recently. I mean, she's grown on a different version of me recently. It's a complicated... We could just go ahead, if you want. I watch the gate. Ain't much else to tell. You a vampire? All right, we're going. 
I keep expecting her to take the lead. She said, let me take the lead. I'm nervous. I have no idea what to expect in here. Are we going to find... Am I going to find a family of Cullens in here? Just like, rich? Wait. Serana? Is that truly you? I cannot believe my Vingalho. eyes. Vingalmo. We got... My lord, everyone! Serana has returned. I guess I'm expected. <laughs> I can't believe it. Oh my god. My this is pretty. My daughter returns at last. I trust you have my Elder Scroll. After all these oh. years, that's the first thing you ask me? Yes, I have the scroll. Oh, of course, she has I'm the scroll. to see you, my daughter. Must I really say the words Yikes. aloud? They are eating humans. Ah, if only your traitor mother Blood were here. Everywhere. I would let her watch this reunion before traitor putting mother. her head on a spike. Now tell me, <laughs> who is this oh my god. you have brought into the Immortal, don't eat me, please. This is my savior, the one who freed me. For my daughter's safe return, you have my gratitude. Tell me, what is your name? <laughs> you first. <laughs> I'm indigestion. Who are you? I am Harkon, Lord of this court. By now, my daughter will have told you what we are. I mean, yeah, but it's also pretty fucking obvious. This this woman over here is fucking munching loud noises. I I I couldn't help but hear it. Truly, I wanted not to hear it, but I can't help but hear it. You're a reclusive cannibal cult. I don't really care what you are. Perhaps you should. I count some of the oldest and most powerful vampires in Skyrim among the members of my court. For centuries we lived here far from the cares of the world. All that ended when my wife betrayed me and stole away that which I valued Your most. daughter or your scroll? What happens now? I don't want a reward. You have done me a great service. Okay. And now you must be rewarded. Can I have that Elder Scroll? There is but one gift I can give that is equal in value to the Elder Scroll and my daughter. Is it my life? I offer you my blood. Take it and you will walk as a lion among sheep. Men will tremble at your approach what? and you will never fear death again. What? I'm a werewolf. What will happen if I accept your gift? He's going to make me a werewolf? Or a, a vampire? Yes, I can smell it on you. The power of my blood will purge that filth and make you whole again. And if I want to remain a werewolf? I will banish you from this castle. I will spare your life this once, but after what? that... What? You are prey. Oh no! You still need convincing. Behold the power. This is the power that I offer. Now, make your choice. Oh no! First off, you look terrifying. You look so. You look like what was that called? What was that movie? Uh, Jeepers Creepers 2? Jeepers Creepers 2? You look like the Jeepers Creepers 2 dude. The, 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 the monster? You look a little bit like the Jeepers Creepers 2 monster. The one with the pipe in his head. Oh my god, that was the first scary movie I ever watched and it gave me nightmares for like five years afterwards. Uh, I have no idea. I'll be honest with you. I think I want to become a vampire. I don't want to remain a werewolf. I've never, at no point have I really enjoyed or obviously leaned in on the werewolf stuff. Uh, so like, it's not that important to me to keep it. I don't feel like, oh my God. I think I have to become a vampire here. Am I immediately fucking up the Dawnguard DLC by doing this? Maybe. I think I have to do it, though. 
Be still. Oh my god. God damn it, what? This is insane! Oh my god, my eyes! Where the fuck am I? What is happening? All right, let's go talk to him. Awake at last. Oh. The power is growing within you, and now you must learn to wield it. I would have never guessed that this is where we're going. I would have never guessed that this is the direction this Don the Dongar DLC would have headed. We're on the third episode. I'm a fucking vamp. What is happening? I'm a fucking vampire. This game. I'm ready to learn about my new powers. What happened? How did I get here? My blood is potent. At first, the body is overwhelmed by it. After my bite, you collapsed and fell into a slumber. Now your flesh has acclimated to the new blood that courses through your veins. I assure you, no harm was done. In truth, your strength surprises me. Not all mortals can withstand my embrace. What is this place? A shrine to Molag Bal, the Let's mighty go. Daedra prince who is father to all our kind. Let's go! Our power is a blessing from him. It is he okay. who first bestowed the gift of the ancient blood upon me. That is a incredible piece of lore that I did not expect, but which makes sense and also makes me so happy. Of course, Molag Bog gave the vampires the gift of vampirism. You made a pact with him? In an age long forgotten to history, I ruled as a mighty king. My domain was vast, my riches endless, and my power infinite. But your life was Yet, finite. As my yeah. mortal life neared an end, I faced a seemingly invincible enemy. Incredible. My own mortality. I pledged myself to Molag Ball, and in his name I sacrificed a thousand innocents. <laughs> in reward, he gave everlasting life to myself, my wife, and my daughter, and so I have defeated mortality itself. Are you the first vampire? I have got to know lot, lots more things. Are you the first vampire, and then every other vampire is because of you, y'all? Or had he created vampires before? I have so many questions, Lord Harkonnen. Lord Harkin. Uh, Baron Harkonnen from Duke, uh, or from Dune. Um, Holy shit, that's insane. I'm ready to learn about my new powers. With my guidance, you will become a deadly instrument, <clears> striking <throat> terror into the hearts of mortals wherever you tread. Now listen to my words and do as I instruct. The true power of the ancient blood is found in the form of the Vampire Lord. Assume the mantle of the Vampire Lord, and we will continue. It's that girl. I knew it. I knew immediately upon waking up here and seeing her, I was going to have to eat her. Into the vampire Lord. That's what you mean, right? I'll teach you more. I will. I will. But first, this is insane. Look at the mouth. The oh my God. It's so scary. Blood to for sure. For sure. I will. I will. I will. Lord. Give me. I hear you. I hear you. Those are bones. Yeah, those are bones. Give me two seconds, buddy. Use the power <laughs> I hear you. I just want to see. I just want to see. Who is she? I was going to say. Transform into the yep. vampire lord, and I will By, teach dude, you more. I, under I get it. Trust me. I understand. <laughs> I understand. Interesting. Okay. All right. So, 
couple things. Vampire Lord, transform into a Vampire Lord, use the revert form fa uh, power, which isn't here right now, but will be, I'm guessing, once I am one, to change back. Vampire Servant, reanimate a weak dead body to fight for you for 60 seconds. That's probably like Serana's uh, uh, Draugr. And then Vampire Sight, improved night vision for 60 seconds. Are those just the 60 seconds after you become a vampire? I don't know. I honestly In this form, you can drain the life from your foes with your right hand. Sorta of hate it. With your left hand, you can wield the power of blood magic to raise the dead. You can also call okay. upon the powers of night to turn into a swarm of bats and reappear some distance away. Okay. Should you run out of magicka, you can descend to the ground. And fight as the beasts do. Do so now, and we will continue. Control to change between magic and melee modes. So now I am melee. You are weaker while on the ground because okay. you cannot access the this is insane. magic. However, the night powers are still yours to command, and your claws are still formidable weapons. Over time, your powers will grow in strength, and you will find new He's ways talking with his hands a lot. Use your gifts. Tab to view the Vampire Lord perk tree. Okay. So, so far similar to Werewolf in the way that, like, has a perk, uh, shit, has a perk tree. 50 bonus points. Uh... Protect all creatures, even dwarven automatons. Uh, everything slows down while you move faster. Transform into an invulnerable mist while health, magic, and stamina regenerate. Killing a person with a power attack restores all your health. My powers and blood magic cost 33% less. Melee attacks do 20 points of poison damage. Surrounded by a cloud of bats that feed on enemies with me within melee range. That's insane. <laughs> What the fuck? Blood magic, blood magic can pull a creature to you. Sorry, our dogs are going crazy downstairs. Somebody must be at the door. Uh, can pull a creature to you from a distance. Do choking damage once it's close. Conjure a gargoyle to fight for you. Target is paralyzed. Wow. Was I supposed to do something with it? Was I supposed to select the first one? No, I can't. Okay. There is much to learn, but if you master the powers of the Vampire Lord, few enemies will be able to stand against you. Select your powers from the favorites. I see. Okay. So, okay. Raise dead, revert form, Vampire Sight. There is one last thing you must know. Okay, that's the site. Playing mortal men with your life drain grants you new night powers and blood magic. Okay. I keep a stable of thralls in the castle. Is that my right hand? You need to feed like the baser vampires to stave off the sun. That is all I have to teach you. If you wish to be reminded of these lessons, you need only ask. I have okay. a task that will test your new powers. Oh my god, this is a lot. Do you have any questions? I'm stressed. Uh, I got lots. I got a million questions. Mostly internal questions, like what am I going to do with this? But also some other ones. Uh, what must I know about being a vampire? As a vampire, you will gain new powers, but also a weakness to sunlight. With each passing day that you do not feed, that weakness will become more deadly but your powers will also become stronger. Your powers become stronger Feed when you don't eat? those who are sleeping and your vulnerability to sunlight will diminish along with your powers. Mind blown. Okay. Tell me again about being a vampire lord. When you first transform into a vampire lord. Like this, sure. In the air. While you do, you will command the powers of blood and night. 
Descend to the ground and you can attack with your claw. With experience, your Okay, so those are all under I understand. New ways to use them. I understand. I'm ready to carry out the task for that you're wanting to give me. Good. Go and speak to Garen Marethi. Tell him it is time. He will understand. You ever uh You ever you ever meet someone? in real life and you just you just like who they are so much and you and you really you like them and you're attracted to them and you, your mind starts to do that thing like you know uh what would i have to do to be with this person what would i have to do to get this person to like me and then you just start doing those things and you immediately become a completely different person than you ever were before jazargo is very confused right now how far would you go to get with serana is all i'm saying because I think I've basically figured it out. You know? I think I've basically figured out how far I would go. Uh... <laughs> what the fuck am I going to do now? Okay. Well, well, well. Bloodstone Chalice. Speak with Garen Marethi. I think I have to do this. I have to test some things first. I gotta test these powers out. That's 100% why she is here. Lifeblood absorbed. Vampire perk progress has been increased. So do I have one now? No. So I don't see a... I don't see a thing... Each new perk requires a few more feedings. Okay. I don't see a progress bar. And maybe... I don't know. Interesting. What does this one do again? I don't remember what these are at all. Uh, that's tab. And then favorites is these. Okay. I want to become bats. Can I become bats? Let's do it. Oh! That's ter- Just Argo has no idea what's happening right now, by the way. What do I look like in this way? In this, uh... I just look like a gargoyle. I can't really crouch, but... Otherwise, I, I look like a gargoyle. Okay! What's happening in this game? This is insane. Uh... Let's go back to this one real quick. I want to see if, uh... Ray is dead. Can I do that? This is my left hand one. You're now my... You were a weak body and now you would fight for me for a little while. Is that right? Okay, let's revert. Indigestion's vampire cattle. Uh... I am incredibly freaked out. What would you like to do? Feed? At this point, I'm just trying to figure out the... Uh... Mechanics here. Your vampiric powers recede as you feed. It's true. But also, I'm like probably one closer to... Uh... Shit. I can't... can't really tell um your vampiric blood gives you 20 percent weakness to fire okay okay wow i have no idea what to do next hi jazargo how's it going you are taking us somewhere warm i trust <laughs> Kajit will follow never again are we going someplace warm jazargo unfortunately i in fact i've actually uh I've recently taken up a a big hatred for all things, for all things warm. Uh, okay. Well, I guess we go and talk to this person. I sort of want to look around a little bit. Talk to Cusith. 
IQ Sith, you are a very scary boy. Yes, you are. You're a very terrifying boy. Let's just look around for a little bit and ignore. Uh, oh, you died. I understand. You were only there for 60 seconds. That was the cattle. The cattle, quote unquote. Jesus. What you got the cage for, bro? There's some things I want to ask you about. You have earned my trust, so I will share. Is it just I basically can. the things like? Oh no, I thought it was going to be just basic tips for vampirism. But when you greeted Sarah, uh, Serana, it sounded like you hadn't seen her in a long time. Serana and her mother disappeared long ago. I commanded every vampire in the court to look for them. But after centuries of searching without success, I lost hope. In my heart, I know that it was my wife, Valerica, who took my beloved daughter away from me. If I ever see her again, she will pay most dearly for that betrayal. What Valerica. Else do you want to know? Valerian Steel. Okay. I heard you mention Serena's, Serana's mother. Sorry. What happened to her? Her name was Valerica. Is she dead? She's been gone for so long. She's not. Now, I can She's a vampire. She has left this world one way or another. I will say only that we did not part on good terms. What I mean, else do you want to know? You say that, but you also just said a whole bunch more than that. That's all I wanted to ask. Y'all are fucked up. In so many ways, really. Like, look at all of these. Torture. Yeah. Okay, yep. Uh, I think this is for draining blood. I don't think it's for torturing. I mean, maybe both. Maybe both. Okay. What's in the display cases? All kinds of shit is in the display cases. Those are human hearts. A potion of blood? What? This is going to take me a couple episodes to get my head around. Good thing I got nothing else going on this afternoon. It's just me and the Dawn Guard DLC all afternoon. And that is a good thing because... Oh, buddy, do I got some figuring out to do. Oops. Uh, what is the Adabala? Do I know that? Um, memoirs of Mori House. Okay, okay. Ooh, it's in here. Is this your bedroom? Is this where the magic happens? Oh, it's your... Yes, it is. You don't have bedrooms. I forgot. Oh my. Oh, it's, yep. All right. Just diamonds. Just diamonds and sapphires sitting on a plate. What What do you use them for, buddy? Is it cool if I call you buddy? What do you use them for, dude? What do you do with them? All right. So. Oh. Creepy black hole. Okay. IQ Sith. I thought there was somebody behind the door. What the hell are you doing back here, bud? You're welcome here. As long as you don't overfeed on the thralls. It's so dark in here. As long as I don't overfeed on the thralls, are they in here? What do you mean by that? What do you mean by that? Just a lot of wardrobes in here. Uh, okay. What's in these what's in these big vats? Nothing? You're new here, so I'll explain this once. You feed from the thralls as much as you like. You kill them, and I'll split you in half. Where did the thralls come from? All over Skyrim. It's my job to collect them. I try and keep something for everyone. For every taste, I mean. Sometimes you get one who comes willingly. But most have to be convinced to join us here. Threatened? Good day. For sure. Definitely threatened. Good day to you as well. Y'all got a real fucked up thing going on here. 
real fucked up, I would say. That is going to do it for this episode. Holy God, I'm a vampire now? What? I have no idea what the next 10 episodes are going to bring, but I cannot wait to figure it out. Uh, thank you so much for watching this episode. If you enjoyed any part of it, a like or a positive comment down below helps us a lot with the YouTube algorithm. I got so many questions racing through my brain right now, and I'm sure you do too. We're going to have to find them out both together tomorrow at 12 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. We'll see you there. Until then, bye bye